Hello, hello, slave decorators! Welcome to Decor Lab. In this video, we will be showing you how to create this beautiful balloon Christmas tree. Are you guys ready? Let's get started. Okay, so we are using one, two, three, four sizes of the balloons. So we're using a 17 inch, we are using 11 inch, 9 inch, and a 5 inch. So here we're using two shades. We're using a shade of red and we're using a shade of green. To create a shade of red, we have double stuffed the red balloon inside of the crystal fuchsia. And for the green balloon, we stuffed the black inside of the forest green. So now to the fun part, we are going to inflate our balloons to the certain sizes. Um, and we can create a sizer if you don't have one. To do so, we are going to use clamps, but you can use two boxes, two chairs, you pick it just something so you can slide the balloon in between. Our biggest balloons are going to be the 17 inch. We'll start it from the bottom of our base. Speaking of our base, this is the base we're going to be using for our balloon Christmas tree. So now I want to create a sizer, right? So this is a DIY sizer that we are going to use to size our balloons to make sure they're all the same size. Basically each layer are going to be different size. Um, so our 17 inch, we are going to inflate to about 12 inch, I would say, to the, the first layer. So I'm putting my measuring tape, measuring 12 inch here and putting my sand clamp on a 12 inch mark to secure it. So this is a 17 inch balloon inflated to almost its full capacity. As you can see, it has a pear shape. What we're going to do, we're going to press on it and uh, release the air. So it will change the shape and also get closer to the diameter that we need. Like that, I think I need a bigger. That was too much. <laughs> A little more. Perfect. I'm tying only the balloons that are inside, so it is easier on your fingers. We are going to inflate three more balloons of this size and put them in one cluster. Let's do it. So this is what your cluster is supposed to look like. Now let's put it in vase. So don't be afraid that it, that it moves as you like release it because when you put the next cluster on top, they will stay in place. But basically, this is the shape you are looking for. So the next size, we're gonna go about half an inch to an inch smaller. So now we will add this cluster on top of our first cluster. As you can see, our top cluster holding our, our bottom cluster in place. And just like that, we will we'll be creating the clusters and putting them on top of each other until we hit the very top of it. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter how many inches it is. The goal is to have each layer slightly smaller than the previous one and each layer to be the same size.
There you go. So the goal for your balloon to still have the stretching capacity, right? So you see, I kind of can move it. Like I will be able to shift it on a base. So this is why when you feel like, oh my gosh, this is too tight, make it smaller. So now we're going to create our fillers that will look like ornaments. For that, we're going to use a red color and we'll start from a two and a half second inflation. That will give you a balloon and about three and a half inch diameter if you're still using the sizer. And here you have it, a balloon Christmas tree. Here we use traditional colors, green and red, but you can use any other colors that you want. If you guys choose to use this tutorial, make sure you tag Decor Lab School on a social media. I cannot wait to see what you're going to create. And I will see you in the next video.